Hello and welcome to another video with me Elmo J. Coriolan and it's good to have you along. Today we're checking out the Court G200 which I've, I've really liked some Court guitars that I've tried so when I saw this I was like hey value for money this could potentially be one of the best guitars that I've tried on the channel and I really like recommending good gear to you people so I jumped at the chance and bought it. The Court G250 was very nice, the G260 was extremely nice and the Court G110 while being uh, a bit cheaper still is actually one of my favorite budget friendly guitars that I've tried on the channel. So this one costs 205 euros here in Europe, you can let me know what it goes for in the States. Swamp Ash, Maple Neck, Maple Fretboard, 22 frets, Court Power Sound pickups and a 6 point vintage trem. So some sounds and pictures while I play and then uh, do clean, crunch and overdriven and then do a whammy bar test at the end and then we'll get a conclusion. So starting off with the Roland Cube which is set to clean. Some crunchy stuff, I did some at the beginning, but uh, without the reverb. Still have the delay. Thank you. 
Okay, let's tune up and do the whammy bar test. Before I do, um, it does have a bit of fret sprout, nothing major, but occasionally when you play, uh, when you strum, you get that. But that's how it's in tune now. Let's give it a bit of a go and see what happens. This guitar is a bitter disappointment. I was so hoping to be able to recommend this to you. And on the surface of it, a lot of it looks good. I really like the natural finish. That's just clear coated. But there are issues here. This, I mean, fret sprout, it doesn't stay in tune. When you touch the whammy bar, it just goes mental. This piece of rubbish here. I mean, why is that bent? It's just 200 euros. But I've had better guitars for 100 euros. Sorry, Court, your quality control really screwed up this time. One of the issues here is, again, as with the Donner, the, the screws here are they're drilled in at an angle when they should be more in line with the body which means that the springs do this, which means that it can't really work to its full potential. <coughs> Good thing that I buy the gear that I review, because if they'd sent this to me, they'd sent me a proper one. They'd have sent me, they'd, they had, they would have, they would have sent me a proper one. Don't get this, yeah, get something else. If you want good cheap Strat alternatives, there's a video here. Please consider supporting the channel via one of the links in the description. You have Patreon where you get access to my music lessons and a bunch of exclusives. Affiliate links for gear that I recommend. If you buy something that way, you support the channel at no extra cost to you. Or you can buy my music. But above all, I hope you have a nice day. I hope you liked this video. Take care. See you. Bye!